Hey guys, I'm back and I got a cool tip for you. Quick shout out to Tom Talks blog that I published just a while back. What I'm happy to share is, did you know you could connect your team's desktop client to a WebEx meeting? Yes, you can. Let me show you how. You can do that using a SIP address, but you would have to create this SIP address or construct it. Sometimes it does appear in the body of a WebEx meeting, but let me show you how. I'm about to start a personal meeting. I've set up my settings so that there's no meeting password, but this also works if a meeting password was there. So I've started the WebEx meeting. Typically you get an invite in Outlook. You have the message body that gives you the meeting information. So I'm gonna just bring that up here because I'll need that information for Teams. So in Teams, what we could do is we're using a SIP address. We would type it in the following format. Now I'm using the free service from WebEx, so I'll need to proceed this with a meeting number and a location. So I'm gonna go with 64, what is it? 637, 62, 627. 403-118 dot, and my location is meetings, Amer 18 at, uh, and this is working off the Skype for Business SIP address, or was previously done, at link.webex.com. I would search for this external and present it with a Teams chat dialog. Once you see that type in your message, you should be able to click the video icon and this will start to call the WebEx meeting. We turn off the camera just to avoid multiple feeds in here. In just a moment, you should see that I've joined the WebEx meeting from my desktop client using Teams with that address. There you go. Awesome. Well, thanks for watching. Hopefully you found this useful.